Hello YouTube, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to make vanilla cupcakes with a fresh raspberry buttercream icing that will be perfect for Valentine's Day. So if you want to know how to make these amazing cupcakes then make sure you carry on watching this video. To make the cupcakes you'll need two large eggs, you'll need 130 grams of self-raising flour, you need a teaspoon of vanilla extract or essence, you'll need a teaspoon of baking powder, 130 grams of caster sugar, 130 grams of butter, I use cakes butter such as stork, and then for the buttercream you'll need 150 grams of butter, 300 grams of sipped icing sugar, and then you'll need roughly 150 grams of fresh raspberries. You then want to line a muffin tin with 12 cupcake cases. I'm using ones that say baked with love. You want to preheat your oven to 180 degrees. If you need any conversions, then just leave a comment and I'll get back to you. The first thing that you want to do is cream together your caster sugar and your butter until light and fluffy. You then want to add your two eggs, a teaspoon of vanilla extract, sieve in your baking powder and then your self-raising flour and whisk until smooth, pale and fluffy. Perfecto! Add in the cake mixture using a dessert spoon and a teaspoon. Whilst the cakes are cooking in the oven, you want to make your raspberry buttercream. To make the raspberry buttercream, you want to place in the raspberries into a small saucepan, reserving 12 of the raspberries which will go on top of the cupcakes. Now you just want to heat up the raspberries on a medium heat until they kind of dissolve almost, and then they just make this beautiful juice which we then sieve to get rid of the pips. Once the raspberries have then just mushed down almost, you want to make sure that you do just squish it down with a metal spoon. It just releases this beautiful juice, but you want to remove the seeds. So get a sieve and a measuring jug, and then you just want to pour this into there. And then what you're going to do is you are going to then just press down firmly in the sieve to get all of the beautiful juice that'll be coming through and so you remove the pips because you don't want those at all. The smell of the raspberries are just amazing. So carry on doing this. To make the buttercream, first of all, you want to place the butter into a mixing bowl and you want to whisk this up first until it is light and fluffy. Then you want to make sure your ice and sugar is sieved. I've already previously sieved this. If you do not sieve in your ice and sugar, then it will leave lumps in your buttercream and it won't be the desired smooth buttercream that you want. To prevent a ice and sugar explosion, put a tea towel over the bowl carefully and whisk it up. If it's not coming together, then add a few tablespoons of milk just to make it that smooth texture that you want. Halfway through, go around the side of the bowl with a spatula to get any of the remaining ice and sugar and bits of butter that haven't been fully whisked. Time to put your buttercream into your piping bag. Now with your piping bag, you wanna put your desired nozzle inside first, and then that can gauge where you need to snip it so it comes through. Place your piping bag into a measuring jug and just fold it over the edges. And then it just makes your buttercream a lot easier to place into the bag without getting really messy. So with your raspberries that you just mounted down here, you just wanna add this into the buttercream. Don't wanna mix fully, because I wanna get kind of like a two-tone effect. So I'm just gonna very softly swirl this around the buttercream. Then you wanna place your buttercream into the piping bag. Before you decorate your cupcakes, you wanna make sure that they have cooled completely. Otherwise, the buttercream is just gonna melt and it's gonna look a mess. It's actually really funny reading some of these love hearts. One says sorry, 
why would you, why? You shouldn't be sorry if you love them. Um, another one says bad boy. <laughs> now, get your buttercream, like so, and then you just want to squeeze it right down. Now, working from the outside, you're going to work your way in. There we have it, some beautiful raspberry and vanilla cupcakes, perfect for Valentine's or for whenever really. So the proof is always in the testing. So that is perfect. So really well risen cake. Light and fluffy, not too sweet because you've got that sharpness from the raspberry, which just goes perfectly. I hope you've liked this video. Make sure you subscribe and hit the notifications bell so you know when my next video is coming up. Happy Valentine's and I'll see you again.